Hey, um, the Lord of Gwent, are you willing to just vassal? No? Okay, it's probably because I don't... If I were to create the Kingdom of Wales, I could probably take a couple of them, but then I would start handing off the actual Kingdom of Wales to multiple people when I die. Like, England would get one and Wales would... and another person would get Wales, and that would get messy. Okay, we're gonna go beat their ass now. They're running away. <laughs> oh, no, we caught them. We'll win. They have more knights than us, though, but we have a way better commander and way more troops. Wounded, my injured vassal. Oh, it's my marshal that I hate. He got wounded. That's cool. I hope he dies. Oh, our awesome spy master died. He was actually good. Okay, the only powerful vassal I could pick is not a great spy master, and I don't trust him. So... This guy it is for now. That guy I'll have to do. And hey, um... We should look for secrets on that guy, because I don't trust him, and I want to catch him doing something he shouldn't be doing. You need to conquer Devon Dudley? We're working on it, we're working on it, we're almost there. Oh cool, our marshal finally died! Thank god, he had a hook on us, that's the only reason he was marshal. Oh my god. Oh my god, we can have a way better chancellor. Look at that. Skill 27. Good god. We are switching that. And the the one who is our old marshal, or our old chancellor, she can be the marshal now. Because she's a little better at that than the previous garbage guy. Okay, that's good. An experienced fighter in the country? We could use more knights, couldn't we? Fifty bucks? He's really good. I will actually pay that for him. Yes, someone with Marshal 19. Do I have a I don't think I have a powerful vassal with Marshal 19 though. Yeah, that's not a powerful vassal. I could put them in charge, but it would really piss off the Countess here, and I'm trying to get her to like me more. Man, we lost a few big people in that battle, actually. Weird. Well, we lost a few people I didn't want anyway, so... Not even that mad about it. Alright, I'm gonna chase him. Just so we can get the, the final fight done, you know? I would really love to ha have this uh, army here raise up a few more... Um, a few more knights... That'd be really nice. Whatever, we can just chase him for now. Oh, who's that? Those are raiders? I really, really don't want to fight that massive group of raiders. They can just raid that, I don't care. Okay, we're going the long way. Are you still working on powerful vassals liking you? You still need that uh, to change the creating titles on death. Oh. Uh, yeah, that's what we're working on right now. Is uh, making our vassals like us more. Sacking Gloucestershire. I can make 30 bucks to help them rebuild. I'm happy with that. Wow, they raided that fast. Oh my god. Focused recruitment. Good. God, that group raids fast. Here we go. There we go. Faction crit against me. Lollard populists. Oh no, not the Lollards. Not all ten Lollards. Easy win. We have... Devon. Finally in our country. That's a very well-developed land. Okay, well, I will ha hand off this land, which is less developed. Okay. We're, almost, we're 16 months away from finishing that culture flip? Okay. That, okay, that guy's already converting a religion. Cool. Um, we need county control in our new land. And he's going back on the water. Cool. Right, we need to hand off land again. Um, 
Who are my vassals within Wales? This guy, my son, I'll hand it off to him. Whoops, I handed him off Devin when I meant to give him the other one. It doesn't matter. We'll inherit it when, uh... We'll inherit that when we die anyway. Not a huge deal. That's what I get for playing a little too fast. It happens. Almost no consequences. I'll lose a few dollars. Doesn't matter. Ooh. I've discovered... Uh, that the inherited contract obligates him to more than you have collected. Mm, I can raise somebody's feudal tax rate. Hell yeah, I'm going to. And he's barely even upset about it. But I get more tax money. Okay, just march the army away so that it's far enough away that I can just disband. Thank you. We're making 19 a year now. That's Or 19 a month, sorry. That's... That's big money. Okay, I these raiders left and then came straight back. So... I'm gonna raise all the armies in the area. What is this? Enemies! Frisia, pretty weak. Ally, much stronger than them, I will accept. I will join that war that I probably won't do anything about. Yeah. Yeah. They can fight that one on their own. I'll pretend I'm helping. <laughs> Espionage. Unbeliever. I mean, we already know he's an atheist. It doesn't really matter. Enemy ally joins war. We'll still win. Okay. The armies are together. We have massive advantages in this. Let's do it. We have pretty much equal numbers. But our commander's way better. They're being led by their queen! The queen of Denmark is leading this raid. We might kill the queen of Denmark. <laughs> oh, we are slaughtering them. We are slaughtering them. They're in full retreat so fast. Oh, my nephew real quick GG died. And it was the educator for this person, this daughter, who's rowdy. Well, we'll get them a new one. She's getting intrigue education. Our choices are fucking awful. <laughs> uh, this guy, because he exists. Who lost what? Oh, those guys I just beat up lost another war. That's fine. Oh, we got some money out of uh, Raid Loot Recovered. That's cool. Got 116 bucks for that. We killed 4,000 of their troops. They only killed 1,000 of ours. Is that going to make them run? Lost our commander in that battle. That's a shame. He was a good one. Okay, they're probably leaving now, so I'm going to disband. Get a little money again. Neighboring ruler lost war. Yeah. Cornwall's independent. Is it? Oh my god! Cornwall just went independent. They have an alliance with... Oh my god. Guys, France exploded. <laughs> France exploded real bad. <laughs> Whoa. 
I'm on realm view, right? I'm on realm view. That's France. I'm zoomed out and everything. Oh man, mainland Europe is disgusting. <laughs> that is that is some border gore if I've ever seen it. I think the king just lost an independence war that just about everybody was in. So just about every vassal just became their own independent leader. That that is going to be ugly. All of those little dukes and counts are going to declare war on each other nonstop to try and like centralize power. That, yeah, that is like Boxer Re Revolution. Yeah, Boxer Rebellion China kind of shit right there, where the country has exploded into warlords. Oh, man. Didn't you control click? No. <laughs> See, this is, this is if I go like control click menu. It's like this. No, this is France now. They don't have a liege up here. That's just what it is. How did that happen? Likely they had an independent civil war. And the independence faction won. And so everybody involved became independent leaders. You can centralize that power. I could centralize that power. Now, this does mean that Catholics uh, have a little bit less strength for a little while. They're decentralized. If other religions want to start holy war in the Catholic world, there's not much we could do about it. But Cornwall? You want to you wanna be my vassal? Yes, you do. He'll agree to it. We got Cornwall. Look at that. This stream, we got all of Cornwall into England. We got two new counties. Two. We got three new counties today. One through Conquest, two through Vassalage. So if we look at our claim to just England itself, Kingdom of England, de jure, is this land, right? Do we own all of it yet? I think we own almost all of it. Not yet created Duchy of Cornwall. We can create that and hand it off to someone. So all we don't own now is Northumberland from Scotland. How strong is Scotland nowadays? Way weaker than they used to be. They're already defending in multiple wars. They have strong alliances. They have very strong alliances. Their alliance with Lithuania is the biggest problem. Lithuania is a very, very strong country right now. What are these troops? Light... Those are archers. They have a lot of archers. Oh my god. Huh. Okay. Yeah, we got some Denmark and Northern Scotland. I don't think Scotland even has Scotland's capital anymore. I think Sweden has it. I'm feeling pretty good right now, I gotta say. Grant vassals to rightful liege. Why would I go doing something silly like that? Are people mad about it? Let me check, like, a random dude. Doesn't seem like it's, uh, an overall issue. Prisoners can be ransomed. Almost, he almost has the 100 for that. Now that one's worth 25, sure. So is that one. Sure, if you can pay in full, pay in full. Okay. Now that France exploded, you should take advantage and seduce the Pope. <laughs> Scheme at court. Can we the discovery? My marshal is scheming against my guest. Why does everyone scheme against this guest I don't care about? You can... I don't... I don't care. Um... Yeah, I don't care. Okay, we have a lot of money on hand right now. Are there any decisions that we've been holding off on that we should do? We could get some knights. You know what? It's cheaper than ever to do that. I'm gonna I'm gonna try and get some knights to help um help get a better army together. It's time we start really improving our troop quality. <laughs> Can you vassalize countries and uh, counties in fi uh, France? No, because we're not their de jure leader. Um, if we had a claim to like the kingdom of France, then sure. But I mean, we could declare some wars and just start conquering. 
Because I do have a vassal that has claims in their land. I'm not going to lie, it's tempting. I don't know how well we'd be able to keep it. MBD, that's not my acronym. Uh, what are your plans like take over rest of world or are you going to try to take Great Britain? Uh, Britain first. World of Conquest would be fun. I'm just taking things as they go. Pull for war against some of France. I could. I just don't know if it's a good idea right now. Oh, we found out that someone is a bastard child. Man, we are making great money. I would love if my vassal, or if my uh, men-at-arms limit was higher. How close are we on that tech? Communal government is about three years away. We're 80%. Hell yeah. Then we can finally, finally get the thing I wanted. This guy's talented. He's a eunuch. He's scarred. He's got a decent enough opinion of me. Recruit to court. 35 bucks? Not that bad. <gasps> Bleeding out. Oh, we gain stress no matter what happens here. Oh, but we are so good at learning. We can do the medical treatment. Sweet. I'm inspecting the barracks inf infirmary when a severely injured soldier is brought in. He's oozing too much blood. Where's the physician? Insert name is nowhere to be found. A chill runs down my spine. I might be this man's only hope. Suddenly, as if she stepped out of thin air, my cousin, Duchess Whatever, is at my side. She rolls up her sleeves and looks at me. Hand me the tourniquet. There's a 100% chance that the Duchess becomes my friend. I gain some learning lifestyle points. I get a strong hook on the guy whose life I save, and he joins my court. Do it. Boom. We got a learning lifestyle point for that. Our patient screams and thrashes, even though three grown men weigh him down. Every step of the way is a battle. But Duchess Whatever remains calm, and eventually, a quiet focus settles over us. I'm not sure how we managed it in the end. It seems like the soldier will live. That was an impressive feat, Joni James. Ageth says with a tired smile, It was an honor to serve by your side. Couldn't have done it without you. Hell yeah. Want to take a moment to... Uh, take appreciation to your Twitch and your YouTube channel. You're a big inspiration for me. I think you're an amazing person, and whilst I don't try putting you on a pedestal, I appreciate that. I still want to give you the appreciation for all the free content you have. Have a great day. Thank you. I appreciate that. I'm I'm happy that I make some kind of positive influence on people. I I do often get messages from people basically saying that they are inspired by me, but that they know not not to assume I'm flawless or to put me on a pedestal, because that's something that I talk about. I don't want anyone thinking that I am in any way better than anybody else. I only try to compare myself to me and who I used to be. That's, I think that's really, really important, actually, is that you just focus on improving yourself based on your own standards rather than trying to compare yourself to others. But hey, look, we're making 21 bucks a month. Oh my god. That's without, without collecting taxes. In six months, I will check real quick just to see how much extra we'd get out of collect taxes. But I'll probably still focus on... That was a misclick. I'll still probably focus on, um, on promoting culture. Faction against me. Welsh Adamite uh, populace. There's, there's got to be like one of them, right? Fucking Welsh nudists. Yeah, look at all these weak-ass factions. With one or two members in each one. Nothing. How much does learn on the job boost your stats now? Oh, 20% of your um, chancellor's stats will go to you now. So that brings us up, ooh, that brings our stats up quite a bit, especially our learning up to 24. It's a shame our arch archbishop sucks, by the way. I'd really like a talented one. This guy's feeble. His prowess is lower because of it. He's Yeah, he's not as good. I might hire him. Build a university to increase learning tech. We don't have the tech level to do that yet. Chivalric spouse. Ooh, combat advantage. Stop reading, just do play game. <laughs> sorry, sorry, I shouldn't laugh. For all I know that English is your 20th language and I'm being an <laughs> asshole. Just something's funny about how the way you wrote that. Half the game is reading. Reading is the game. All right, Wolfhild comes of age. Not that Wolfhild, uh, daughter Wolfhild. 
Uh, she is now a flamboyant trickster. Not the best education, but whatever. Oh, a new hearsay. Down in Croatia? She's Croatian. Down in Transylvania. And they are... Messalanism? I've never heard of this. They're hostile to us. It's an organized Christian faith. Believing that the essence of God can be perceived through the cardinal senses, the Messalanians reject traditional Christian sac uh, sacraments and instead seek to experience God directly through less con conventional means of worship. I am not going to join that religion. They're probably going to get holy word into oblivion. I'm good. They do believe that something's going on, then keep checking. And our daughter here can marry... Do I want some alliance power? Our alliances are very good, I will point out. Best place for CK2 for beginners? I don't know. A lot of people have told me they learned the game through watching my Let's Plays of CK2, because I did quite a few of them. I also did a tips video on CK2 that's like five minutes long, if you want like a bunch of really fast, useful tips. Although I think one of the tips isn't relevant anymore because one of them got patched out. It's like something about having to... You used to have to be really meticulous about making sure that tribal vassals or tribal countries have the troop count that they say they do. You used to have to like click around on all their vassals. You don't have to do that anymore in CK2. Use daughter to get claims in France. I don't really want claims in France right now to be honest. I'm kind of just focused on the thing. There's that emote again. It's like sleeping day nine or something. I don't know what that one is. I don't get Twitch emotes, to be honest. Don't really understand. Uh, don't really understand. What the fuck they're supposed to mean. The prideful prepare for war. Oh, do we have a crusade? Oh, we're going for Jerusalem? I like how no one explains what the emote does. They just use it more now. <laughs> okay. Um, I could join. I could finance it. That's a lot of money for very little piety, to be honest. I will consider joining in the future. Right now, I want to get rich while they're all busy wasting their money. Done promoting culture. Beautiful. Go down and do that in Devon, probably. Yeah, because we're going to inherit that at some point. Take four years. It's worth it. Hold on. How much money would we get out of this? That is a lot, but the culture is more important. Knight has arrived. This one's fairly talented. Health boosts and stuff, too. Oh, man, the premiere starts in, like, 10 minutes. Okay. It starts in 15 minutes. We'll go 10 more minutes, then. We'll go 10 minutes, and, um... And that'll just have to be how it is, because I'm... Super busy today. Got extra, extra work today. Couldn't get everything done. First time in a while that I couldn't get everything done on schedule. What's going on down there? Vassal Wars? Pretender Rebels. Oh, it's Vassal Rebellions. It's fine. It won't actually leave my country. I don't really care who the vassal of that place is, as long as they swear fealty to us. How's this war going? Oh, we're still winning that war that I haven't participated in. I am being raided. I didn't mean to close that. Where? Up there? Oh, that's not that bad. Mm. Oh, nope. They're running away. <laughs> Nope, they're running away. Okay, never mind. Well, that was a waste of a slight amount of money. <laughs> the, 
the day that I say I'm not busy is the day that hell freezes over. Well, it's only a few months until I pass uh, the 10 years mark for a video a day. Then maybe I'll have more time. Did you ever hear of a game called Endless Space 2? I think I have Endless Space 1, but I don't think I've played it. They're raiding up there and... Oh, they're going right back on the water again. More time for what? My life. I work like 75 hour plus weeks. I only started taking days off like three months ago. Now I take two days off a week. It's very, very difficult to get everything done in time. Neither gold? Oh, fine, I'll donate gold. Empty my coffers, I'd be crazy to do that. I will spare a few coins, I'll spare $300 for it. That's a lot of money. It's a lot of money. The war chest is looking good, though. No more video a day? It'll probably still be lots of videos, don't worry. Co-streaming CK3 with Gooset. We actually have been recording a little bit on our own time. Um, so that will upload at some point, but not streamed, no. Happy to see you live. I'm happy to see you live, too. I guess that that's grammatically correct, right? I think so. Remember the game Satisfactory? Yeah, I was playing it a few weeks ago. That game is pretty fucking sweet. Okay, they're just raiding right there again. I don't care. Our vassals will take care of it. Keep finding secrets. A lot of little mighty secrets in there, but nothing big. Sacking of Dokum. I'll pay 30 bucks to help them rebuild. That's like nothing. Should host the feast. I don't think we've... Oh, no, it has been five years. Okay, yeah, we'll do it. Thanks for the reminder. Okay, we got rid of most of our stress. Disaster strikes. The wine has gone bad. Mm, everyone will like me more if I pay 160. There, I bought new wine. And a duke likes me more. Yay! I'm not going to go super in-depth on the events with the, the feasts, just because we've seen most of these, but if we see something clearly new... Unconcerned with any etiquette, my vassal, mayor, whatever, slaps me on the back. I mean it, he exclaims. I'll do anything you ask of me. Anything at all. Ask me and it's done. I can smell the alcohol in his breath, but the promise has been noted by every guest present. We get a weak hook on him. I'd rather just get friendship with him. I'm a nice guy. Why are there 9,000 troops in East England? Oh, it's like local battles for supremacy and whatever. It's like peasant uprisings. It doesn't actually have to do with me. It's not against me. It's against my vassals. So I don't care who wins. Hey, we're an eager, eager reveler now. That gets us diplomacy and intrigue. Love that diplomacy. When are you playing Hitman 3 with Gusset? I don't know. Oh. You did just hear me say a bunch of times that I'm super, super, super busy. And that I'll be busy until the end of March when I have video a day up. And then I might be busy with other things like my own personal life because I work 75 hour weeks. So whenever you ask, when is this thing going to get done or whatever, it's fairly safe to say it gets done when it gets done. I just have a lot going on. I do not believe we'll ever find anything either. Damn, okay. Who do I not like here? That guy hates my guts. <laughs> Let's spy on him. <laughs> See if we can catch him stabbing people. Okay, money is still good, but we keep having to spend little bits here and there for things. I really want to save up so that we can get the Tower of London and still have a lot left over. How close are we on communal government? We're like six months off. Good. Administration embraced. Hell yeah. 
How close are they on that culture thing? Two years? When they're done, that will move them back to developing the, uh, county... County development in capital. That's what I mean. <gasps> My a countess had an extramarital affair with this man. I'll call it lies. I wanted to say loyal. I'm not. I'm not doing anything. Your sinful ex countess uh, come at a cost. Aww, we're down to faithful now. I don't really care to be honest. I don't care if the Pope likes us a little less. I'd like for them to like us more, but I'd rather not imprison a loyalist. Why are there so many wolf hills? I know, right? The name seems to be pretty common here. Oh, we can no longer continue faith uh, conversion there. I guess um, maybe they already got converted. Okay, well, he can go back to religious relations then, because seriously, I want money. <laughs> and I need to be able to befriend the Pope if I want to be able to ask the Pope for money. Went from episode 41 to now. Probably fine, right? Ugh, oh, I have no idea what was going on in episode 41. Sorry. I don't really remember these things by episode number. They all kind of blend together. Oh, hey, look. We won the war we never participated in. Beautiful. Hey, can you pay for this in full yet? Yes, you can. Good. Pay for it. Okay. Sanctioned loopholes is by claim interaction, which is cool. I just want to get down to Scholar, because Scholar is pretty solid. Yeah, that's five learning and development growth up. Sanction loopholes. We might buy claims at some point, but I'm not really looking to declare a war right now, to be honest. We are in a very good way, and I would like to keep the economy strong right now. We need to build up a bank. What even is your personal life up till now? I mean, you did do one video a day for almost two years. <laughs> no, I've been doing a video a day minimum, average of 11 uh, videos a week. For nine years and ten months. The ten-year point is in two months. Um, what do you even do with your free time not to pry? I work out. I, I uh, meditate. I work lots. I spend a lot of free time trying to help small YouTubers who are up and coming that I find and stumble across and that I think are really good. Um, whether that be like bigger ones or smaller ones, usually it's ones that start off smaller than me. But I, I try to, like, seek out ones I think are really good and talk to them and try to help them out where I can. There's people like, um, Salt Factory. Which, by the way, I want to point out, like, not taking credit for anything Salt Factory has done. He's fucking incredible. In fact, he just got married the other day, which is awesome. Uh, but, uh, yeah, I, I just try to reach out to people and just tell them, like, hey, I when I was um, a new YouTuber, I, I had a lot of questions. I didn't have anyone I could ask who'd done it for a living. So I just... Try to reach out to people and let them know, hey, you can ask me, you know? Anyway, um, generally I go to them and do that because I know that if I were to just open that up and anybody could come message me, I would never be able to get back to people. Um, so I usually make that offer specifically to people. But, you know, do you play games in your free time? Yeah, of course. What little free time I have, I usually spend that time playing video games with Fatima and stuff. But my free time is usually dedicated to working out, trying to eat well, watching wrestling, just relaxing. When I'm not working, I'm doing recreational things. I'm sure it doesn't surprise you to hear that. I'm sure that applies to everybody. Okay, now we're working on battlements. It says 14 years. I don't think that'll be in this guy's lifetime, but it will be in the next guy's lifetime. How's Fatima doing? Uh, you mentioned the other day she's taking a lot of classes. She's having a hard time keeping up and everything, but that's natural. She just started back up in, in uh, university for the her first time doing schooling in quite a while, uh, considering she was mostly doing that, like, you know, fresh out of high school and stuff. Um, then she worked for a long time. So, yeah. Uh, invited to a feast. That'll be a fun way to start the next sesh. There we go. Okay, next session will start with a feast. Don't forget your premiere, don't worry. I, I will do the premiere in a minute. Um, I You stay in the chat. I'll find somebody real quick to raid. I'll, I'll find someone that I follow who's got like a low viewer count. We'll raid them, we'll make their day. It'll be great. I gotta rush to do like a thousand things. I might be working really late tonight. Uh, and it's a bummer, but it happens. But if things go as planned, maybe, maybe, maybe tomorrow I can just have a nice gaming day with my wife again for the first time in ages.
ages. It's been like weeks. I've been missing that. Thank you everybody so much for watching, and until next time, have a nice day.